Podcast. It's Elizabeth and Anthony here with your September 18th edition of DSMS TV News. Today's Ceramics Club meeting has been canceled. There is also a yearbook club meeting today after school. And now to a video from Mr. Hummer and Miss O'Boyle. Good morning, Desert Shadows Middle School. This is Mr. H and Miss O'Boyle in the newsroom. We are here to share some good news uh, yes. about things that are happening in Desert Shadows. First, tonight, I would like to give a shout out to all of our NJHS inductees. Uh, tonight is the big ceremony at 7 p.m. in the cafeteria. It's my great honor uh, to welcome so many students to the uh, National Junior Honor Society organization. It's also a good time for our seventh graders to think about NJHS as a goal for next year. Each year, uh, we induct students to NJHS. It includes opportunities to serve our school in different ways. Um, there are special uh, events and a trip to California. It's all a part of NJHS. Yes, also want to congratulate all the students. We know you worked very hard to get your grades where they need to be, and it is quite an honor to have so many of you here at our school. I also want to give a big shout out again to our athletes that participated in festival this Saturday. You represented our school with pride and it was an honor to watch some of you compete as I did on the softball fields. Uh, so again, congratulations to those folks. More good news at Desert Shadows. We expect that over this fall break, uh, when we're away from school, there's going to be some workers here that are putting up a new shade structure so that we'll have more space to eat and enjoy ourselves on our campus. Uh, we take pride in our campus, and your teachers and staff and our community uh, wants to see that it stays real nice. You'll notice that we got new, um, new benches a couple of weeks ago, and we'll have some shade to put those benches under. Yes, and also, um, unfortunately, over the weekend, we did have an incident that we need to talk to you about. We might need your help. And as I said, we are going to need your help because you never know when things are just going to get flipped upside down. So, we, like I said, we had some incidents this weekend. And Mr. Hummert's going to tell you how you can help us out. We came in this morning and found that we had eggs on our campus and um, some tables were overturned and even a, our new tree that was out in front uh, was, was broken in half and that's going to die and that's, that's too bad. So uh, we take pride in our campus. We hope that you do too. And we want to find the people that are responsible for the destructive activity over the weekend. Um, we would like you to report these and you can do it anonymously just simply put it on a piece of paper and take it to the main office or give it to your teacher uh, let us know who's responsible so that we can hold them accountable uh, for the destruction keep in mind you know it's taxpayers dollars that pay for our tables and all the things we do to keep our keep our uh, our desert shadows middle school uh, a great place to be so help us uh, by reporting that's our news for the new studio we will see you in the courtyard. Oh yeah, see you there. And now to the birthdays. Hey guys, it's Tati with your birthdays. Today's birthdays are Caitlin Pate, Joshua Now, and Sydney Kaiser. Sorry if I pronounced any of your names wrong. Have an amazing day. Now to the sports. It DSMS, it's Aaron and Connor here with the sports. Desert Shadow 7th grade softball showed up to play at the festival Saturday. Both teams each won three games and lost only one game apiece. The B team lost in the championship game, taking second overall, overall in their bracket. While the te while A team bested their opponents despite losing the first match. And here are your 2017 grade All-Stars. Both A and B basketball teams won championship at the festival. Here are some pictures of 7th grade winners. The basketball festival results. 7th grade team 1 first place, team 2 first place, team 5 first place, and team 6 second place. The 8th grade results are team 1 constellation champs. Team 2, t second place by losing one point to Vista Verde. F team 4, fourth place. Team 5, second place. And Team 6, first place. Here are the 7th grade and 8th grade graders who have been selected for the All-Stars.
Back to the anchors. That's all for today. And remember to stay classy, DSMS. First things first, I'ma say all the words inside my head. I'm fired up and tired of the way that things have been. Oh, ooh, the way that things have been. Oh, ooh. Second thing, second, don't you tell me what you think that I can be? I'm the one at the sale. I'm the master of my sea. Oh. Ooh. 